How's it going, everybody? Welcome back. My name is Cuban Cigar, and we're back on Satisfactory. And I am going to do something a little bit different than I did the last episode. I did do a little bit of work um, after the stream last night. I kind of encased a lot of this, um, kind of cleaned up a little bit of how the ore gets to where it's going. And I did actually set up the reinforced iron plate. I'm going to show you guys that setup. Because you'd already seen me do it before, it wasn't just something I felt that needed to be highlighted again. But as you can see, I've got the iron coming in. Um, because I was only using, I was only using like half the iron and half the copper that I was bringing down here, and I'm still, I still have some copper left. Um, <clears throat> so I may, I may set up an AI limiter setup down here with the rest of the copper. Um, I kind of have to do the math on. How much um, copper do I actually need for making the sheets? Okay, so it looks like it's 30 from what I can tell. Let me see. Um, 15 and 15. And these guys are doing, what, 22.5, which is not what they need to be doing. They could be doing... I, I could be using one of these to go, let's see, 15... Oh, so it's 45 divided by 2, right? <clears throat> 22.5. Okay, so that's why I've got that done. <laughs> I had already figured that out. Okay, so my thought on today's episode is I want to set up a little bit of a modular uh, steel production. And I'm going to do it like right over here um, because I think I'm going to set up an AI limiter set up here. I am going to leave a gap starting another building um, over here and maybe eventually we will connect the two together but for the moment I, I think I'm gonna leave it but I'm gonna start on the bottom floor instead of working up here this is going to be a separate structure that's gonna be devoted to steel production and as we advance in steel from basic steel to more of the advanced parts um, this is how it will grow from here so that's kind of my thought um, I have a pretty good idea on how I want to go about it and how I want to design it, but it requires a recipe that I don't think I have. So if I go, let's put down a refinery really quick. If I put a, or a foundry, sorry. Okay, if you look at the foundry, I've only got one steel ingot recipe. <clears throat> there is another steel ingot recipe that uses um, iron ingots and uses a third two-thirds of the oil so a third less oil and a third less iron okay um, yes it adds another step of having to smelt your iron into ingots before it can go into the foundry but you yield 33 percent more product so I think that's worth it so we're gonna get in the Explorer and we're gonna see we're gonna we're gonna grab the one down there we saw a, a pod down there maybe I'll just go on foot because that way I'm gonna have to fight stuff right so I may as well why don't we just go on foot we'll fight some stuff it's gonna be great um, so let's head on over what do I have on me I have all sorts of crap on me that I don't need I don't need any of this junk let's get rid of all that um, I've got so much grass and wood going on right now that I just don't need it okay um, so we're gonna try and find this recipe hopefully we can find it quickly so that how's it going Greg Hopefully we find it right away so that I can get this this steel set up going. Um, what is this? Oh, it's just pure sulfur. I don't need sulfur right now. I know I'm going to need some soon. I'm also looking around because I think there's another drop somewhere around here that I just haven't come across yet. Um, there we go. Take you out. Take you out before they before they release their little spitter dudes or little little light okay there's there's the site but i'm i thought there was another one right in this area so let's grab those um i might have to do some oh you're a big boy oh you are a big boy oh oh are you stuck
I think he's stuck. Well, we're going to take advantage of that. He might be too far in the water for me to do anything against. So we're just going to have to take him out like this. I don't think I could swing at him where he is. Let me see. Or do I? Yeah, see, because I swim. I, I, I think he put himself too far into the water. <laughs> so we're just going to take him out. What do we need here? Nothing? Oh, hells yes. That's my kind of freaking hard drive. That's awesome. We're going to go ahead and take care of this guy. I think I got really lucky with him ending up in the water, but at the same time, you know... Let's see if I can take another couple more shots here. There we go. All right. That took care of him. We'll grab the few goodies we got around here. Me as well. I don't really need them, but I'm going to grab them anyway. Um... Go from behind. I would swim. That was my issue is I kept swimming every time I went in the water. Now, there is another one around here. I just, I don't know exactly where it is. Um, but let's get a ma'am down. Get this hard drive researching right away. Uh, there we go. And we can get rid of that. Okay. Um, let's look around. I, I could swear... I'm missing some... Fr oh, I see right there. Thank you, thank you. Oh, ho, ho. thanks for that, Chris. It's on the island near the oil nodes. So over there? It's over there somewhere? Okay, we can head over there. If you're telling me that's where it is, I'm going to take your word for it. What's its requirement, though? Oh, we got a couple. Yep, far side. Okay. Let's take care of these idiots. Don't recall. That's fine. We'll figure that out when we get there. In the meantime, I love the stun reward. It's my favorite. Because it stuns. It's so friggin' awesome. Um, what were you guys guarding over here? Huh? What are you guys guarding? They're usually guarding something. Well, nonetheless, let's, uh, let's make ourselves some foundations and see if we can't go across to that got a zoop here. There we go. Let's see what we can find on this island, huh? Journey to the Mysterious Island. We just need more, um... There are a few hostels around it. Four normal fluffy tails, one alpha fluffy tail, and an alpha spitter. Oh, wow. So what you're telling me is this is going to be a bit of a battle. And then we got those idiots. I hate those things. No, that's... No, that's one, the net, next one. Oh, so over there. So what's on this little island? Okay, well, we can go over there. That's fine. You're saying over there. Okay. Well, let's head on over. If you, quick, you can get the slug without dying. Oh, that one up there? Okay. Uh, we got all sorts of stuff going on over here. This is getting real interesting, but you're telling me it's over here. Okay. Let's go take a look-see here. Well, this is cool. We got some pretty cool stuff going on over here. Um, let's see. I need to get over there. 
So let's do foundations and let's just go ahead and zoop on over, I guess. I'm actually in the water, and that's something. Okay. All right, let's go and see. Well, let's get this guy taken care of. All right. This is clearly the oil nodes. Yep, crude oil. Oh, I didn't see you over there, buddy. There we go. Aha. How's it going, buddy? How you doing, huh? Let's reload. Let's reload. Uh, let's get up here so we can see. Let's get up here where we can see. Here we go. He doesn't seem to be all that interested in me right now. Um... Okay. All right. Gotta love the stun rebar, I'm telling you. That thing is freaking cool. All right. Where is... Whoa, we got another one. Okay, let's reload. Takes care of him. Just kind of head on over here. Take care of this one. And take care of this one. Alright, we'll be going... We'll go west. West. So it's that way. Oh my gosh. This is... Okay, we got company. We got some. We got some of these idiots. Hold on. All right, let's let's heal up a little bit. Let's take care of these idiots. I'm gonna wait for them to kind of just chill, just slightly. Come on, you can do it. Mm, they're not going to, are they? They're just going to sit there forever. All right, screw it. Then you do that. That's how you, that's how you get the old in out. There we go. I got to do the same thing to that one. Okay, but let's take care of this guy first. Hopefully we can. Actually, they're, they're more dangerous than he is, so let's go take care of them. Okay, here we go. And there we go. <laughs> take that, you jerk. There we go. All right, now take care of him. This is a great oil mine place. Yeah, I figured. This is one part of the reason I, I wanted my base to be over here. I knew that there was this, you know, there's oil here and there's gas like right over there. Um, looks like there's another drop way the hell up there, but I think that one might be covered in radiation. All right, we'll keep going west. Make sure this bad boy's reloaded in case I need it. Keep grabbing some of these. Oh, we've got another one. How's it going, buddy? Nope, it cleared the one. Wait. This is a great minor. Nope, it. The one on the hill. Not sure I understood that. Oh, here we go. This must be what you got. No, so this is just a yellow bug. I thought this was a hard drive over here.
Hang on. It's a yellow slug. What else? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, there it is. There it is. I see it now, guys. Okay. All right. No rad. Okay. So let's do this and go right there. There's a purple on the corner. All right. Well, we can take care of these guys here momentarily. Um, but I want to go get this hard drive first. Oh, I see right here. Did I bring my boom booms? I think I did. I did. I brought my boom booms. Uh, we're going to put the boom booms here. And we're going to put these there. <laughs> oh, yeah. Nice. I brought my boom booms this time. I brought my boom booms. Okay, let's go across. And how much inventory do I still have? I still have a decent amount. It'll be okay. Let's get up here so we can assess. All right, we've got a couple of piggies or bulls or whatever you want to call them. Hogs, I think, is what they're officially known as. Ma'am is complete. Perfect. And then there's the alpha. Okay, let's see if I can draw these guys out one by one. All right. That was one. There's got to be something good over there. Because those guys are guarding it like freaking crazy. Ooh, hang on. That was a spider. <laughs> You're trying to come down right on top of me. I don't think so, big boy. Spear or slop. Take care of him, no problem. Where's your friend? Where is your friend? I know this area a little. Yeah, a little. You know it a little. You pretty much told me everything I was gonna freaking take on. Oh, a computer. Okay. Um, what's this thing need? Nothing? Oh, it's my favorite kind. It's my favorite kind. The kind that requires nothing. All right, let's get a ma'am down. Okay, let's hope. Let's hope I got the steel that I wanted. Not. Um, don't forget the heavy frames. I will grab them. Uh, I need some advice here. This seems like it'd be stupid. Alternate charcoal. Steel screws is the best. That's I kind of figured that. Um, that's a lot of screws for one steel beam. So let's go with that one. Three is good, yeah. I'm going to go with that one. Confirm. Hard drive. Let's get another one going. Okay. And then where? There they are. Let me go back around. Grab those. Okay, so we got one more up there, right? We can go get. What are these guys guarding, though? I'm super curious now. Is it just the power slugs? Because if it's just the power slugs, that's just dumb. Let's just get out of here. I, can, I don't really need... It's close to... Close to bog site. Bauxite, yes. It is close to bauxite, you are correct. That, I know that up there somewhere there's probably some bauxite. It's a yellow slug, that's all that they're guarding, yeah. It's, you know, I don't, like right now I'm not really overclocking anything and I have slugs and stuff. I'm sure later I'm gonna regret it. I'm gonna be like, oh man, I wish I had more slugs. But right now, I don't really need them. 
I'm not at that, you know, I'm, I'm not at a point where I need a bunch of slugs. Okay, let's see if we can figure out where this drop was. It's up there. How in the hell am I going to get all the way up there? I mean, that is freaking up there, dude. Whoa. Okay, that's a big alpha, and he's just protecting one of those stupid artifacts that don't even do anything in the game. Um, there's more oil. Wow, there's lots of oil here. Um, so let's go five and see if I can somehow build a way up there with four meter ramps, I guess. We're going to give it a shot. This is going to be real janky. There are a couple in the desert that are easier to get. Yeah, but I'm nowhere near the desert, Greg. <laughs> I'm so far away from the desert. Okay, well, we're getting up there. We're definitely getting up there. Look at this. This is crazy. I can see my factory over there. I'm not far from the rocky desert? Oh, okay. There is a guard. Okay. There's a guard up. I've, I've assumed there would be. There's always something guarding something up, you know, in this game. Like, anytime I see creatures, I know they're guarding something that I might want. So, I'm more so concerned about what's the criteria for this guy. Um... See if I can. Let's do that. And then go to foundations. There is an SO, a drop pod to the south at that waterfall. Okay. Over there? Or. Oh god, this is this is real sketch. You're talking about over there? All right. Well, let's get up here first and see what we're what we're dealing with. Um, no long way. Okay, I see. see the guard. Okay, that's reloaded. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to take out that stupid... this thing. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. There we go. Way, way south on the waterfall of death. I think I grabbed that one already. Way back, way back when. The, you're the, you're the one causing troubles. I'm pretty sure I grabbed that one way back um, when we first, the first time we went out looking for um, drop pods. I'm pretty sure I grabbed that one. Not the one is on. Not that one is no longer. Yeah, there was nothing. There's a there's a drop pod, but there's nothing to open. I know which one you're talking about. Okay, what do you need? <clears throat> Three heat sinks. I can't even make heat sinks. Update six removed it. I can't even make heat sinks. Man. All right, well, we're gonna mark this guy right here. It's gonna say drop three heat sinks. I probably did. It, hang on. There we go. Okay, so that's kind of unfortunate. Um, there are, a, there were a couple here. I don't remember. Drop heavy modular frame and this one, crystal oscillators. But I don't remember the amounts that those wanted. Um, oh look, there's another something or another there. Twenty-four more computers. 
Okay, well, this wasn't as, uh, removed, either removed or moved, not sure. Yeah, I don't know either. Um, let's see, so where am I? I'm not, not that far off from back at the Massilia cave. There's the bauxite. Is this guarded as well? Yes. Oh my gosh. Oh my freaking gosh. That is heavily. <laughs> Leave your climb infrastructure in place. I will. I will. This is uh this is crazy guarded. Look at this. Holy cow. Okay. Well, I think I'm gonna head back. Unless you guys know of another drop that's nearby here. I'm um, trying to look if there's anything down there I can see relatively easy. I should have another... I should have another hard drive just about ready. That's the way to the Rocky Desert. Okay. Got two more minutes. And I don't have another hard drive. So once this one's done, we're done. So let's see. It's not as guarded as the bauxite that is in the red tree, like four big boys. Yeah. And is this one pure? I've got a feeling it is. But I don't, I really don't want to go find out. Um, one, two, three, four, and two big boys. Oh, both are okay. Well, oh, I see a drop right there. Check it right there. We're going for it. Okay, that means these guys got to go. All right, he's done. Take out his buddies. If you like, you need. It looks like you need a gas mask. I may. We'll take a closer look when I get when I get down there. I want to see if I can get this one's attention. There we. Okay, I've got his attention. Oof. He's he's got like a like a like a spray one type of deal here. Right, he's taken care of. One of his kids is coming to help him out. Whoa, buddy. He's like a shotgun. Uh, I'm lucky they're still a little jerky. Yeah, otherwise I would just be completely destroyed. I'm pretty sure these guys would have tore me up if they were, if their AI wasn't a little screwed up. Let's see. There we go. Alright, let's reload this just in case we need it. AI with what well, AI. No, there's no AI, you're right. Um where's the one I just saw? Did I lose it already? Come on, where are you? Okay, the MAM is complete, so let's go check it out. Um, what did we get? Oh, neither is the one I wanted. Um, encased industrial pipe. Stun rebar, it actually has a little bit of time. Yeah, it does. It does. I don't think I'm going to need the alloy yet, the copper alloy. This might be interesting because then I can use pipes and beams to make the industrial, the encased industrial beams or whatever, or encased industrial four per minute in an assembler. So you guys let me know, one, two, or three, which one's the best option? I'm thinking it's three. You guys tell me. 
The encased is the best choice. Currently, the pipe is easier. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Um, let's go. Okay. Well, now we're on the search for more hard drives. Because I didn't get... I got... I got a decent recipe. That I found useful. You get more pipe from the ingot as opposed to beams. That's... Yeah, you're right. You get a lot more. Okay, where is this freaking drop? Okay, there it is, right there. All right, I see it. Right there. Just gotta keep my eye on it. Okay, so if I get down there, I'm on it. Okay. Right here. Doesn't look like it's in gas. From what I can tell. Let's see if I can. What is that noise? I, I, yes, I just don't have one with me. Because <laughs> Greg. I, I'm never prepared, buddy. Like, anybody who's been watching me for since I started streaming will tell you I am never... I never come into any situation prepared. It just, it's just not... It's just not part of my... My play style. I like to just go in all freaking... No preparation, you know. Let's go down to there. Okay, we're reloaded. Um... Trying to view on YouTube with 480p. Oh, that's not good. That's kind of crummy. I'm sorry, man. 480p is sucky. All right, let's get back. Because I got spiders. I heard the spiders. Oh, it's that thing. Okay. Wasn't a spider. So I hope... This one doesn't have some crazy requirement. Um, where's the rest of them? Where's the rest of them? No? All right. Let's grab all of our goodies. Um, what do you need? Oh, yes. I have that. <laughs> I just wanted some biofuel. You can have all the biofuel you want, man. I've got so much of that stuff. Okay. Let's see here. What else? Am I missing a modular, a heavy modular frame somewhere? I got some screws I don't really need. Um, okay. Did I miss anything? Doesn't look like it. Looks like I got it all. Let's get the mam down. Get this bad boy researching here. Hard drive, start scanning. Let's go. All right. There's another one right there. Um, I'm now at the Rocky Desert. Yeah, and I see that guy right there. I should still have a ton. Ooh, I don't have as much concrete as I thought. Ooh. Hmm. That's going to cause me to think about this a little bit. Um, is there a... I can walk here from... From my coast, right? Like, if I go back... And head down... I could probably walk all the way here, right? It looks like I can, right through there. And then I can go around and get to the one that I want. Or, I could disassemble this. I don't need this. Um, I just need the one I have back there. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, relax. Relax, buddy. 
There we go. Yeah, I got the one on the other side. That's the one I need. Right. Got it. Okay. That should have given me a decent amount of concrete back. Yeah, it did. Okay, so we need to get down there. Oh my gosh, that is a long freaking way down. I'm wondering if it's worth taking this trip, you know, working my way down slowly to get over there. Because I'm also going to be able to discover stuff while doing that. So that might be... That might be the way. Let me see. I could also just take the drop. I won't die. Um, but that seems silly. <laughs> that seems really silly when I'm sure there's a way down there. Right? There we go. This is probably where I'm going to drop down and hurt myself, though. Because I think I've run out of... Um, oh, I don't have to hurt myself. I could just... I could make myself a way down right here. And there, this won't hurt me. There we go. Alright, let's head over to that pod that we saw. And see what we can do with it. Okay. Watch out there, space kitten. Alright, we're gonna need... Mm, no, we can just head over there. I'll just walk across. It's fine. Let's just go. No reason to build yet. You know I don't you care, so right? Lucky that you found this most valuable artifact. Alright, what does this one want? Well, first of all, it has one of these stupid things. There we go. Is there a second one? There's usually a second one. Yep, there it is. There we go. Okay. Let's grab all the things first. Make sure we get everything, because I tend to forget. Or I tend to miss something every time. I just kind of walk right by it. And then you guys are like, you forgot the heavy modular frame. Okay, what do you need? 30 megawatts. I think I can handle that. Power, biomass. Biomass. Okay. Um, let's split that in half. Throw that in one. Throw that in the other. Oh, that's right. Those are 30. You're right. The 30s, I only needed one. But I got my hard drive. All right. Let's get the old uh, MAM down. We're already researching, so no reason to do that. Okay. Now, is there another one in this area that's relatively close to where I am that I could get? Um, I should probably mark this as a drop done. I did not do that with the last one. Um, I didn't do this with the last couple. Uh, that's that's a that's a mistake on my part. Okay, I usually mark these as as done, so that if I'm gonna, you know, if I'm out exploring and I come across it. I don't, I don't worry about it, right? So I need to go back that way to head back home. Um, so let's go ahead and do that. Is this another one? Oh, yes. Yes. So glad I came this way. All right. Well, these guys are simple enough to take care of. Ooh, modular frame. Some wire. What do you need? 
You don't need anything. I like you. Let's just pull the damn handle. Oh, it needed... <laughs> I had what it needed. That's why it was... That's why it just said to pull it. Hog remains. Uh, sure, whatever. Um, did I miss anything? It doesn't look like I did. I think I've got it all. Explorer is that way. 21 rotors. I just happen to have those on me. Um, so, new marker. Drop. Done. Select icon. This one. And apply. There we go. Okay. So, let's start heading back toward home. And maybe we'll come across... I think I might see another one. Or is that just a rock? Might just be a rock. It's just a rock. Okay. We gotta go this way. I'm gonna start heading back home. But at least now I know. Rocky Desert's right here. That's not... This was not that far. And I walked it? Yeah. That's awesome. There we go. Jump across there. What are you guys guarding? Probably a slug. That would be my guess, that they're guarding a slug. Do I want to swim across this? I guess I do. Why not? Oh, it wasn't even deep. We got one of those right there. I bet you just staying on the beach is my best bet. Pretty sure. I can move the fastest if I'm just on land, right? So... Probably should just do it that way. I know pretty soon I'm going to come up. What in the Sam heck? Oh, it's like inside of a bolt, like a rock. That's cool. I don't want it, but it's cool. All right, let's head back home. I'm hoping I get this recipe. If not, we'll just, we'll build our steel facility, our steel plant without it, but it'd be nice to have it, you know? Um, I could always go back to the other ones if somebody wants to tell me how many heavy modular frames and how many crystal oscillators. Um, because that would make life a little bit easier for me. Am I already, like, practically... Oh, we gotta change this one. So, select icon. I forget what I had the... I think it was just an X. There we go. Right? Is that what I did with these? Yeah, just an X. Okay. Yellow slug. Could swear there was another one, like, up here somewhere, though. <clears throat> then the one over here somewhere. I think it was it right here. Is this where it was, guys? I think so. Just gonna go ahead and mark it. Think this was it. Um, drop. Done. Uh, icon, this one, select, apply. Pretty sure that's about where it was. It's probably a close enough guess that I'm, I'm okay with it. I thought there was more though in this little area, but it's okay. We did, I did just hear the ma'am go, so. This is a motor that uses crystal oscillators. Again, with the copper alloy. And a pure caterium ingot using less caterium with water. Now, I'm not at the state of having manufacturers yet. What do you guys think? One, two, or three? I've got a feeling three is my best bet. But I've got a, I'm pretty sure you guys are going to say the motor is a better bet. What do you guys say? One, two, or three? <clears throat> what does the chat say? 
Greg or Chris. I can, I can wait. And then, personally, you think three? All right, Chris, what do you think? Are you in agreement with, uh, with Greg there? You also think it's the Caterium? That's what I thought it was right away. Oh, here's the one I got to mark. I didn't mark this one, right? Yeah, I didn't mark this one, so let's go ahead and mark this one, too, as drop done icon. I should have one more. I have two more hard drives. Okay. Sweet. Let's freaking go. Didn't take us that long to get back over here either. That was relatively quick. You don't have refineries yet, but the pure recipes are a good way to get rid of unwanted water or so I've been told. Gotcha. No, I don't have refineries yet, just like I don't have the manufacturers yet. Okay. So is this something I can get rid of? Can I blow this up? It looks like I can blow it up. I guess there's only one way to find out, right? Reload. It is not. So, for future reference, guys, you cannot blow those up. <laughs> you cannot blow those up. All right, so if I'm going to make this place, I'm going to need to go probably there. Did I cover it? I did. Perfect. Okay. I just want to make sure that I have the right height is really what I was looking for. Now I'm lined up with it. So now I can just kind of go. I don't know how big I want to make this yet, but let's um let's go ahead and put the man back down. I'm going to go ahead and grab this one. And we're going to search another one and get rid of you. Um, don't need it. Don't need it. Okay. So, let's go back to another piece that I was going to work on here. While we, while we wait for the hard drives to do what they're doing, I need to set something up where I can get coal over here. And the way I'm going to do that is from the coal node at our steel plant right now. I also need to bring Caterium over here, which will be the Caterium node that I'm currently using. I've already figured out that if I run this straight, I will end up right on the edge of that island. And then if I go that way, I'll end up essentially right here by the Caterium node, okay? Which then means it's as simple as just running the coal across this way and then that way. Wouldn't be too bad. It really wouldn't. Um, or I can run the coal this way, you know, this way, then this way, and then that way. Um, I worry about building over this big void because if I fall, I'm screwed. Um, so that's why I'm kind of thinking about following this edge here. And I could also eventually turn that into a road, right? Or a train track or something. So. That's kind of where my thought was, but we're going to have to grab ourselves some more concrete, I think. Um, this is all full, isn't it? Everything's full. I really need to get a uh, awesome sink going over here. For sure. Where are you at? I'll take both of those. And let's go see what we can do about <clears throat> bringing over the coal from our existing steel plant, right? Because I think I'm going to actually get rid of it is, is probably what I'll do. There we go. Let's see here, go straight across like that. There we go. Is 
see that's the drop you were talking about right there it's no it no longer exists there's nothing there to search i did it the other day i went over there i was off stream and i was like oh that looks pretty cool i wonder what that is you know and i went and checked it out and it was nothing i was like oh that's annoying let's see so where am i relative to those i'm not white there. Let's do one more. Um, if I look on the map, I'm pretty much right up against it. So we're going to go two more over. And now we can start going that way. And that one up there I've gotten too. And you can see my steel facility right there. So that just confirms to me that this is not, this will not be that far, like at all. Um, and then what we're gonna do is while we're here, we're gonna set up a miner on that bad boy. And we're gonna lift it up to here. Um, I'm not gonna power it quite yet, but We'll get it going. There we go. Steel is over there. All right, so fire, we're gonna do a miner. I would do it just like this, just like that. And then I can do a Mark II lift right on it, right to here. It's probably too high, right there. And a Mark II belt to right here. Just like that. And Actually, let's try that once more. Hang on. If I do that, I could probably turn it into a, um, I think that'll work, I suppose. Probably straighter before, but if I do it right there, I'm good with that. Yes, it's coming upward, but it's straight, so I'm okay with that. So once I get that bad boy connected, I'll have Caterium going to our new setup. Okay, now I need to go that way. I don't think I ever unlocked... Um, See, am I, I'm pointed right at it. Let me see here. It literally is just on this angle. So if I do this, right, can I, like, that's a thing I can do, and then I can just go that way, right? And eventually, there'll be a triangle piece I can put here that'll connect right there, right? Um, can I put an awesome shop down? I don't have my tickets. Darn it. Oh, there's, there's a triangle piece that gives you the 45 degree angle that you want, but whatever. We can work with this. Um, it's not, it's not, this is not lined up right. It's really not. Um, debating. Running home and going to the awesome shop. I think we're going to do it. I think that is not what I wanted you to do. Yeah, we're going to we're going to run home and go to the awesome shop here. And go right here. And let's go to foundations. And five 
to there. There we go. All right. And then we can come back here and... Well, I'm going to get rid of all of this. And I'm also going to get rid of all of this as well. I don't need any of that whatsoever. Because I'm never going to have to step down there and disturb that stupid thing. It's just not going to be a thing i got to do. Oh, oh, oh. oh, I thought I was about to fall. I was like, that's it. I'm going down. I'm going down. Oh, boy. Um... I've done that one. Home is right over there. So let's just head on over. Yeah, let's go. We're practically already there. We're practically already there, guys. Then we can check on the ma'am. Check on some things. Grab some stuffs. It's going to be great. Oh, yeah, buddy. Leave me alone. You don't want any of this right now. You really don't. I'm going to be in a world of hurt. Never did take care of all this, did I? There we go. Oh man, this this was so cool setting this up, these roads. And also that video guy's got a ton of views. Like I was like, do I need to make like a little tutorial video on how to make these roads and the curves? I mean there's they're out there guys. That's how I learned. Um, but if you guys want me to do one, I'll do one. Alright, let me find my find my bearings here. Cause I've got so much stuff on me that I don't need to have right now that stuff um, power slugs I think I have in here um, sort that out I've got some other stuff on me I don't need to have like the computers uh, I think that's it ma'am's done okay actually these computers I'll take back there's my tickets we're gonna put those over here. I've got a box with like all of this like super, oh, I've got a full box with super late game stuff. <laughs> but it doesn't have computers in it. Um, so I guess the computers are gonna go over here for now. Let's go with those in there. Um, the rest of this, the heavy modular frames, I think I had some of those in here, didn't I? Pretty sure I did. I don't. I have some of those somewhere. Must be in here. I could swear I have a stack of these somewhere. Where the heck did they end up? Anyway, that's not, that's besides the point. Let's go here. And let's go to foundations. Corner ramp, I think, is what it's, what I want. But those are corner ramp up and down. These are corner ramp inverted. Inverted ramps. Corner ramp down. Corner ramp up. I thought there was just a ramp that was a corner. Is that not actually a thing? What am I... Mi inverted corner ramp. Hmm. I'm guessing it's this one. It's got to be. Inverted down corner. Inverted up corner one meter. Down corner. Corner ramp. 
Hmm. I guess I could do those. I'm going to go with the inverted. Because I think the inverted is going to allow me to place it flat. So let's do that one. And let's add that to cart. I suppose. And let's buy. What else was some other stuff I wanted? Um, there was some of this stuff I thought I wanted. Uh, these. These are super useful. I got to remember that. Um, let me see if I have any more. Do I have any more? I should. I've got six more. Yes, I'll take them. I want those things. They're very, very, very useful. Um, these guys. Yes. Add to cart. Buy. Um, the other thing I, th the other one I think I want. I get the pillar supports with these. Big concrete, small concrete, big pillar. Okay, I want both of these. Add to cart and add to cart. I'm gonna buy those. Yes, okay, I've used up all my tickets. All right, pretty sure, right? All my tickets are gone? Yes, okay, let's go to the ma'am. Ma'am. Oh. Used quick wire. I really don't see a need for this. I really don't. I'm thinking it's going to be this one. You guys let me know one, two, or three, but I'm pretty sure the motor is probably my best one. I mean, this is, yes, producing 90 per minute, but I've got a feeling this is, a, this is my best... Of everything I have here, this is probably the best one. I, but I honestly don't know. Um, I have one more hard drive that I can try. I've gotten this one a few times, it seems like. You know, you can't really automate, you know, wood, right? So if I could automate wood, this would be smart. Because then I can just use wood for coal. But quick wire is always good. Crystal oscillators are expensive. Okay. Then I'm going to take your word on that. I probably will never use this recipe, but let's just go for it. Confirm. Okay. Hard drive. Scan. All right. Okay. Let's head back. Do I have enough concrete? Let's grab one more stack just in case. Um, we'll just grab that one. Okay. Let's head on back to our little ramp thing we were making. What's up, little truck? You're on, you're just working away, aren't you? Just doing your thing. Um, we gotta go way the hell over there. I can see the ramp from here, which is actually kind of nice that I can see it. I'm not grabbing it. Leave me alone. Harvest it. I will not harvest it. Leave me alone, lady. Oh my gosh. He's always like, harvest it. Harvest. They don't do anything. Like, if they did anything, I would harvest them. You know, can I stick them in the, uh, in the awesome sink? Those, um, my luck is I'd stick them on the awesome sink and then like an update would come out that they actually do something. And then I'd be like, damn it. I can't believe I did that. You know, that would suck. When did I do this? Oh, that was a long time ago. No. I don't remember what my question was. You're answering no to a question that I don't remember. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Greg. Uh, they're going to be used at full release. Oh, okay. Okay. You're saying no, I can't put them in the awesome sink, I think, is what you're saying no to. That makes sense. Uh, we're going to have a big boy here to fight, I think. 
Um, but I don't want his goodies. So because I don't want his goodies, maybe I can avoid him. Here we are. Okay. Now, let's start by getting rid of you and you. And getting rid of you. And you. And you. And let's see if I if I picked the right thing. I probably didn't. But who knows? That's what I thought it would be. Like that. But I need this to be concrete. Okay. That's what I was hoping for. Now the question is, will it let me connect to it? I can go that way. But I can't go that way with it. Well, that's really infuriating. Why can't I connect that way? Uh, okay. Because they're inverted. That, that is why. I can't connect that way because they're inverted. So the only thing I can do... Is throw a 45 degree here. And that's it. Um, let's see. It won't let me. I can't clip one in. You can use it to fill in a hole. Yeah, like I could fill in like right here that but that doesn't quite line up see use a road barrier to get 45 to line up at the corner edge okay hang on hang on I think I think I know what you're trying to tell me to do so like that If I go like this, right? I want to go that way. Um, yeah, I want to point right at it. So if I do that... Pivot on the corner, like that. Okay. And then... If I do, I believe, a catwalk on this side... And a catwalk on this side... Right now I can do one of these. And now I can get rid of all of those. And now I can do one of those. And that's pretty close. I think it would have worked better if I had pivoted in the center. But now if I do, I'm curious now. What if now I take this guy and I place him here? No, not quite. Okay, I'm going to try that again, but I want to try it in the center with the road barrier. Hang on. I want to pivot right here. Maybe there. No, I think I think I was onto something with the center. If I pivot there and there I th think that does it let me see I think that's still not quite it is it yeah I guess it's gonna stick out no matter what I do isn't it I could swear there's there's a way to do this Let me point right at it. Right there. I think. Come on. Snap. There you go. And snap. There you go. 
And you can go there. How's that? I mean, I guess that'll work. It's really not any different than what we, we did earlier, right? I suppose. But let's just go. That's gonna that's gonna be a relatively clean transition. I think. My only worry, hang on. My only worry is if I do it like this. Let me see what that looks like. Hang on. The nice thing is when I when I go to make this turn, this turn will be made, I think, really well. Um, foundations. What if I do? Hang on, I'm trying to like make this happen. Uh, I mean, that kind of works because that, I feel like that's lining up to get these and those to line up properly, but it, it just looks atrocious. Um, hmm. I think you might have been right with the whole pivot the corner and just leave it at that. So, road barrier. So, right here, right? One, two. Is that a 45 degree angle? It looks like it's a 45 degree angle. Let's just take it. And we do this. And we do this. And we go. Let me just do that. And that's just going to have to work. After all that, I just wound up doing exactly what you told me to do anyway. <laughs> all right, let's go. At some point, we're going to have to, like, support all of this, I think. We are well on our way. So there's the coal right there. Do I need to turn it that way now? Ooh, ma'am, hang on. Yes! <laughs> we got it. Oh, we got it. Oh my gosh. Yes, confirm. Do I have another? Oh, that's, that's the one I wanted. Okay, do I need to do this? Do I need to do another one going that way? Wait, that's not the coal. The coal's over there. What is that? Is that my iron? That's iron. Or is that? No, that's my bauxite. Or my uh, caterium. That's what that is. Okay, that's caterium. What's up, buddy? Perseverance pays off. Yes, it does. Perseverance paid off for sure. We're at the height of the moth at this point. Isn't that something? Whoa, shoot. Oh, shoot. This isn't... Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Let's eat. Okay, we gotta eat. I can't believe I just did that. <laughs> oh, how the heck am I gonna get back up there? I gotta go all the way back. <laughs> I can't build from down here. <laughs> oh, that's fine. We'll go back. <laughs> oh, wow. <clears throat> I wish I could fly. <laughs> 
Oh, I too wish I could fly. <laughs> you could wear your parachute. I could. You know, that would make a whole lot of sense if I would just put on a freaking parachute. And then I wouldn't have that problem. But I always forget. I always forget, forget to make my parachutes. <laughs> well, you know what? I got the recipe I wanted. Oh, come on, Cuban. Would you get it together, buddy? I got the recipe I wanted. So let's go build what this plant is going to look like, okay? And then I can worry about bringing the coal over after that because I want to get it made because um, <clears throat> this coal part is going to be boring, right? Me, This is obviously not fun. Um, although watching me fall nearly to my death was probably entertaining. So, you know, I'll give it that. <laughs> I, like one more hit from anything, I would have been screwed, man. I would have been so screwed. That's all it would have taken is one little pop. <laughs> one little tiny pop. I'd have been I'd have been done. Plus, this is gonna allow me to bring power um, to that Caterium one. So I would have had to come back home anyway. So this is fine. This is fine. Um so I'm going to have to get my diagram up here in a second. Um, I, I, I kind of pre-planned this thing. At least the bottom floor. And then every everything I do will just be a floor above it and a floor above it and a floor above it. Right? And eventually we'll just run out of floors. <laughs> so let's get over here so I can get the basis of this made. Um, let's see here. Um, I have it open. Okay. Um, so let's see. I need a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We'll go nine by... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so why don't we just do a ten by ten? Yeah, let's just do a ten by ten. It should be big enough. But uh, we'll do it probably eleven by eleven. So let's go ten and ten. That way we have it. We always have a center point. I like to always have a center point. There we go. And then we're going to go through this together. Um, so this is assuming I'm bringing in 120... This will assume 120 iron and 120 coal, okay, which I believe I can get in here. No problem. Um, and as I, as I upgrade my coal or my iron, center point at the name of a shopping mall. Uh, it does sound like a name of a shopping mall, doesn't it? Center point. Okay, there we go. So, and then we can do this all the way. Actually, I don't need that all the way across. Um, what I need is a one meter down here. No. What I need concrete is a two meter to a one meter. There we go. That's better. I think. Actually, let's get rid of this one and this one. And let's just do the two meter. All the way down. I think that clears the water. It does. Okay. All right. Let me get my diagram back up here. I closed it. So I need... 
No, that's not what I wanted. So my iron ore, let's just say, is going to come in right through here, right? So I'll leave this path empty. So right here will be where my iron ore comes in. So let's throw a wall in here. We'll do this wall because the steel is going to come in somewhere. Or the coal is going to come in probably in this row. Okay. So iron comes in. Um, and it's going to go straight to some splitters, right? So if I go logistics and I go conveyor splitter, I'm going to do one splitter right away. And this splitter is, in theory, I'm not going to use this splitter unless I upgrade this line to be a, um, like, let's say we make it, instead of 120, it's 240, or instead of 240, it's 360, or whatever, right? So this allows me to expand this up to another floor, which is why I want to leave this one empty so I can go back up this way and then come back over and, and, and whatnot, right? That's kind of my, my thought behind it. Um, I could also put the splitter on the outside, I suppose. Because then that, that would actually keep keep this clean. So that's probably a better idea. So that splitter will go there. Yeah. Yeah, I like that idea better. That splitter will go there, and if I need it, I can take it. Okay. Um, keep this one open. Um, maybe keep... How many do I need? One, two, three. So I only need four. I only need four splitters in here. Why did I go eight? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Why did I go so big? I don't need to be that big. I can just go right here and leave that open. So I need a splitter here. A splitter here. Splitter here. And a splitter here. All right. Um, we're going to leave it this big, though, because I don't know as I go up in floors and I've got assemblers and stuff, this is probably going to change. So we'll leave it relatively big because it gives me some flexibility. Um, I suppose I could center it more. So if I put you, let's say, here. What is that? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. Did not mean to do that. I need one of those stupid lookout towers. Where, 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 is, where are those? Uh, production? No. Where's the lookout tower? Organization. I need one of these. I need to be able to see what the heck I'm doing. Um. <laughs> What's up, Glass? How you doing, man? Okay. Um, so this is like one, two... One, two, three. So we're going to get rid of you. Put you there. And it can't be fully... I can't be centered because I've got... I've got an, an even number. Or an odd... I've got an odd number. Um, so one, one, two, three. One, two, three. And then four. But that's fine. That's okay. And then here we need to do, um, we need smelters. So production, smelter, and I like to do the smelters back as close as I can. Good, had the longest hot shower ever, and now enjoying a coffee. Nice. Yes, that's exactly where I want that. Yes, that. Um, let's go here, and, oh, come on, here, and, why aren't you, why aren't you, there you go, there, and then you're going to do iron, okay, and then we're going to copy that, we're going to paste, no, nope, no, nope. copy, and we're going to paste that, and we're going to paste that one, and we're going to paste that one, okay. So, iron comes in through here, which I have one more iron node I can bring down here, right? That's not a problem. 
So iron comes in through here, gets fed into these. These can be just Mark 1s because they're going to split off, right? I don't need more than 30, so if I'm bringing a, a 60 line in, we're good. And then these, this needs to be a Mark 2 because this is going to be 120 coming in, right? 120 right here comes in. 60 goes that way, which I don't want, right? So we're going to keep this as 120. And then this one can be... This can be a 60, but I'm just going to leave these as Mark II. Um, I suppose I didn't need that one, now that I think about it. Um, so let's just do Mark I to here. Mark two. And that goes there. Okay. So iron comes in, gets smelted in iron ingots. Step one. Okay, step two is I need to skip one, and then here I need to put some foundries, okay? Now the foundries have two inputs. How am I gonna do this? There's a way... I need to line up that. Pretty sure that's lined up with that one, okay? And then on the other side, I need to line up. This is going to get really tricky here. I don't know how the heck I'm going to line all of this up. Um, so let's try and line up the last one. And then one more goes in between the two, right? So. Ooh, I don't have any more concrete. Let's get up top and get ourselves some concrete. Um, <clears throat> then I'm going to need splitters and mergers and all that fun stuff. Although I feel like my skin has been scrubbed off. Did you exfoliate? <laughs> Is that why? You must have exfoliated. Uh, concrete. Let's see. Let's get some concrete. It's way on the end. Here we go. And we'll grab, we'll grab a couple stacks of concrete. All right. Perfect. Um, and I gotta, I gotta make easier ways up and down all of this stuff, but for now, this is fine. This is fine. For the moment, this is okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna have to play around with the line, the aligning of this, but we'll figure it out. Um, and then one more of you... Okay, that's lined up there, so we're going to control that one. Doesn't line up that side. I mean, that's that's the center. Right there is the center. And it's lined up. So I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it. It's lined up with this guy. Which is fine, because I can throw a merger. Um... So let me see here. So I gotta try and remember how I, I like how I envision this. Okay, so uh, why do I keep closing out what I'm working on for crying out loud? Okay, so here I need to I need to like bring in. I need a merger here. Then I need a splitter here. Then I need a merger here. Then I need a splitter here. And then I need a merger here. That makes any sense. Use a logistic floor. Oh, like, like a a floor underneath that <clears throat> allows me to, either underneath or above, that allows me to send all the piping through. I could do that, um, but I think, I, I think I've got this figured out. So, so my iron are all going to go on the right side, 
right there. On the left side, I mean. So I need a merger. Let me just kind of walk through this. I, 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 I think I've got this figured out. So I need a merger to go there. Okay. And then out of this guy, I need a splitter to go there. And then I need another merger, right here, right there, because then that lines that up. Okay, then I need another, I'm gonna have to push these forward, I think, just slightly. I'm gonna have to push these forward just slightly so I can fit lifts in there. Um, and then I need another splitter here. And then I need another merger there. And that, believe it or not, this all works. Um, and I'll show you guys how here momentarily. It all just kind of like divvies everything up. Um, it just divvies everything up in an even way. So let me see now. If I can fit a lift here, then I don't need to move these forward, but I'm pretty sure I can't. Um, but let me see though. This is a splitter. No, this did not go this did not go the right way. Like that. And then this one goes. Okay. And this is for the coal. So now if I go lift one. That clicked. So that'll work. <laughs> I clicked, it'll work. There's a little bit of a a little bit of a clip here, but I am actually okay with that. Um, so I need another one of these right here, and it's going to have to be right there. There we go. And then we just do the same thing. We clip up there first, like that, and then I need one more splitter. I have to get rid of this for the moment, just so that I can throw this splitter in here. Do I need a Mark II? I don't think I need Mark IIs. I think Mark Ones are fine. Because this is just bringing out 30 to a splitter. Um, but then I'm merging with this, which is sending out 60, which is then splitting to that way. That doesn't need to go. Pretty sure I don't need to make those Mark IIs, but I don't know for sure. Okay. I'm going to make these Mark IIs just because I'm going to have so much coal coming in. There we go. Now, I guess the other way I could have done this, which probably would have been a lot easier, is to just manifold all of the iron across here and then loop it back across here. But... This works. <laughs> this will evenly distribute all of the iron to where it needs to go. I think and I hope. Um, and then you just need to be connected right here. Okay. So now I've got steel, but I, I want this steel. So that's going to be bringing in 40 coal and 40 ingots, right? So you're doing 30. That's 120, and then 40, 40, and 40 is 120. 
perfectly balanced, right? That's kind of my thought. All right, next thing is out of the foundries now, I got to decide what do I want to make? Do I want to make uh, steel pipes or do I want to make steel beams? Well, for the moment, I think I'm going to go with pipes, okay? Um, because... Actually, I should do the beams. I should start with the beams um, just because they require less constructors and it's an easy one-to-one. -one. Um, it's a really easy one-to-one -one if I go with the, the beams first. So I'm going to need a constructor and we're just gonna put one there. One Oh, there and one there. And this is really simple. Um, what I don't remember is the steel, the steel ingots are gonna come out of here. So solid steel ingot, solid steel ingot at 60 per minute. So that's just one. Oh, wait, wait, wait. That is That did not end up where I wanted it to. And that did not end up where I wanted it to. Uh, and that did not end up where I wanted to. Um, constructor. I'm going to stand right in front of this thing. And I want you right there. Stand right in front of this thing. I'm going to want you right there. And stand right in front of this thing. And I'm going to want you right there. Okay. And then super simple. These just kind of all merge together. And that's going to give me... <clears throat> And you're going to make steel beam. And you're going to make steel beam. And you're going to make steel beam. So, this needs 60 per minute. This is outputting 60 per minute. Simple. 60 per minute, 60 per minute, 60 per minute, 60 per minute. Okay? That's a lot of steel beams coming out of this bad boy. All right? And then these are all going to get merged. So... Let's grab a logistics and a merger. And we're going to pop a merger, right? Is that too close? No, that's not. That's actually perfect. And we can do a Mark 1 to the merger because it's, it's all just 60s, right? But then coming out of that, we got to do a Mark 2, if not a Mark 3. Two. And then out of that, comes our storage container, right? So if I go to organization, storage, and I'm out of plates. Let's go up top, get some plates, and then we're gonna run the iron and the coal over here. <clears throat> and then what we can do is figure out the next floor, which is gonna be a copy of this, except the constructors are different. Everything else is the same. <clears throat> Because I'm assuming another 120 coming in and another 120 coal coming in. So it's just going to make it that much easier. All right, so I needed plates and rods. I really got to get a central storage going again. I don't... I liked how I had my central storage at the other place. Okay, let's head back down there. Um, but this is okay. It's fine. It's fine. And I got to get my awesome sink going over here too. <clears throat> but like I said, I'm like I said, guys, I'm super new at this game and I keep learning stuff. And every time I learn something, I want to come and do it. So I'm willing to bet the next time I, I do a series on this, you know, whenever we do season two or save number two or whatever we want to call it, I'm going to go about things a little different. Uh, I'm probably going to be a little more picky on my starter area. So we're going to need one of you to go here. And I need to bring it up one, right? Because I need to go to that. So we're just going to um, change it to making an input. And then we're just going to go like this. Hang on. Hang on. Uh, logistics to... I want it to be an input. And then an output. Yes, that is correct. Like so. 
Okay, so once I get the coal coming in, it'll go through there. Once I get the iron coming in, it'll go through there. And we're going to do the same thing. We're going to put a splitter right here so that if I decide to um, splitter one there and one here. So, like, if I do another floor, I can go off of this and go up to another floor with 120, right? Because I'm going to have 240 coming in. I'm going to want to go up to another floor. That's, that's kind of my logic. Um, same with the coal. I'm going to have 240 coming in. This floor is only going to use 120. This floor is only going to use 120. So I need another floor to use another 120, which is where my next module of this will come into play. That's kind of the thought. <laughs> And then I can do like an encased steel beam and I can do, you know, things like that. Um, so yeah, this is gonna be pretty cool. So let's get up here. Um, oh, I didn't make my storage container. I didn't make my storage container so that once this thing fires up, we're good. And then I don't have to like worry about having a vehicle or whatever. Um, I can just, you know, my main base will be right here. And I'll just kind of run everything to a central storage, which will be over there. And it's going to be pretty great. Okay. Um, I need organization, storage container. I'm going to go as far forward as it'll let me. And then do this. And I'm going to need Mark 3s. There we go. And then later, like, I can throw, a, you know, a um, smart splitter right here. And if it's overflowing, then it'll, it'll send it over to an awesome sink, which I still have to set up. Um, but right now, the task at hand is let's get coal over here because iron's easy. Iron's here. That's not going to be a problem. Getting the coal over here is going to take some finagling. Um, so let's work on that, which means I got to take the trip all the way back to where I was. And do I have plenty of concrete? And yes. Okay. Good. Because that means we are going to grab power from somewhere. Um, I need to grab power from here. Perfect. We're going to grab power and we're just going to go. And as soon as it tells me it's too long, I'll just go back and I'll put it where it lets me. We're going to bring power all the way over. That's too long. If I run out of cable, then so be it. Can I do this next one? Nope, right here. Fine. I don't think I'm going to run out of cable. I think I'm okay. I don't think I'm going to run out of it. I think I'll be fine. Can't do that one, so we'll do this one. I'm just gonna keep going. Keep it just flowing over to where it needs to go. Doo -doo -doo. It's gonna be the corner. And then I'm gonna go on the outside. And then you'll keep going. Should be getting too long here soon. Yep, right there. Okay. There we go. And we are too long. Guys, this is it's like scary being in this in this spot. Seriously. Like this is craziness. See that one's too long. This one is just right. Okay keep going. I don't want to fall. I really don't want to fall, guys. Not again. Really, really don't want to fall again. That would be so embarrassing. I'm not going to connect the Caterium yet, because I simply don't... Uh, I'm not ready to take in the Caterium. I don't have anything set up for it yet, so... I don't want to take it in. I'd like to build 
what it's gonna feed first, like I just did with the steel, before I before I bring it in. Um, I don't know why. It's just something I like to do. I don't have a, I, don't, I don't have a reasoning. I really don't. Can I do this one? Nope. It's gonna be this one. All right, Cuban, don't fall, please. Don't fall. Not this time. Um, we can go here. Cool thing is if I decide to run a train through here, I can make a floor on top of this and it'll be the train floor, right? Like the rail floor, which is pretty cool. Except I got the moth, which whatever. I don't really care, but some people are like weird about the moth flying through their structures. I don't really care. Oh, look at my little truck go. Look at him go. Look at him go. Oh, that's so cool. Okay. Um, you. And we're just going to keep going. Keep going. Keep going. And you go there. Onward. And I got to stop for now. But now I can grab you and keep going. And you're going to go there. And we're going to see if we can keep going. Where's my coal? We're almost there. Do do do. This one? No. This one. Yep. And onward. I'm. I feel like I'm almost on top of it enough to do it. Um. But it, it can be very deceiving, right? Like you think you're right above something and then you're not. Okay. Let's take a look really quick before we continue on. Like, maybe now is a good time to turn that way. Um, architecture. Let's see if we can... That way. We're going to do the same exact method we used earlier. God, this is so scary. Come on. There we go. And we're going to go... Now, mind you, I don't need to be bringing this power over here, but I want to because... If I do truly disconnect all of this and I get rid of all of that, then I, I have no reason to have power running here, right? So, oh God, oh God, oh God. I'm right up, I'm right, right, right over it. I, I, this is gonna be, this is going to be kind of tough to gauge, isn't it? I'm not exactly over it yet. Let me see. Am I over it now? Nope, still not. Still not. Oh, man. Still not. This is one of those situations where if I fall here, I will die because I will fall into the void. Like, no, no doubt about it. I will fall into the void. I think here I'm over it. Um, Freaking feels like it. Um, we're, like, right here. I think I'm... I am right over it. I'm pretty sure. So now the question is, how do I get that up here? Right? I'm going to have to make myself a way down. This is a really, really long way, but it's not as long as it looks. I'll take it. I will take it. Um, 
Yes, that works. Um, so I got to figure out how in the heck am I going to do this? Well, first of all, let's get rid of the belts. Let's get rid of you. Let's get rid of you. Hmm. I'm wondering if I should have started going down. <laughs> I'm wondering if, if right here, this should all just be going down. Hmm. I think it should be. Let me get back up there. I think it should be. Oh, this is so scary. <laughs> this is so freaking scary, guys. I don't like it. I don't like it. Um, let's get rid of you. And then we're going to go all the way back over here. And what I'm going to do is leave this one, but get rid of this one. And then we're going to copy this and see if I can go down to where it is and maybe I can position myself right underneath it because um, I, I need to be a little closer I'm like way 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 too far away right like this is this is still relatively high um, I may even need to turn sooner over here Yeah, I think I need to. I think I need to turn sooner. Let's get rid of all of this stuff. I can take care of that later. Yeah, we need to. We need to turn a little sooner. Um. Maybe we start right here. We just turn, right? Maybe right here we turn to go down. Or we just start going down. Why not? Why not just right here? We just go down. Go down 10. Come on. Just had it. There we go. Let's go down 10. <clears throat> Figure out where I want to be lined up. Thinking right here looks good. So let's get rid of these two. And then let's go with a number eight. Except I don't want, I want concrete. Um, foundations, concrete. Right? And then we, we do a turn to go that way. So if I go architecture... We go there. And then we do this. And then we get rid of that one. Get rid of that one. And now we go down like this. And that gets me a little bit closer. Probably much more manageable. A much more manageable distance, right? Like, yes, this is this is way more manageable. And now, if I go foundations, and let's put one more, so that I can make myself a way down there. And let me see. Yeah, I think, I think I can make this work. Um, let's get rid of you. Let's get rid of that. Obviously that over there is powering this thing. So I'm gonna have to bring power over. Well, sorry about that. Cause if I get rid of all of this, there's no power here. Um, so, you're going to need a tier 3 lift. And then we're going to go up there and see if we can bring it up in a way that we can see it. Right? So... Let's 
go up one more. Let me see if I can get this to to do what I want it to do. I kind of want it to go on the on the outside, like right here. I mean, it's not straight. Um, it's not exactly straight. Let me see here. Hang on, guys. Bear with me. Then I can bring it up a little bit more. way um i can probably get up there okay uh let's get rid of you let's do it again with the logistics mark three then we're gonna go all the way up there that's gonna be great it's gonna be great you'll see it's gonna be awesome <clears throat> I think there. I think that lines up pretty good. I don't like that. That's super freaking annoying. <laughs> it's so annoying. Um, but I think I know what to do. If I do Actually, why don't I just why don't I just do this, right? No, I'm going to try the whole cap um, road barrier thing. It doesn't work with this, does it? No. Okay, fine. I just got to, I got to be okay with it. I got to be. It, it's just the way it is. I got to be okay with it. So we're going to go on the outside of this, like right here. think right there is good and what I'm going to do now <clears throat> is get rid of all of that along with that along with that <clears throat> which means this thing is no longer being powered by that over there it's being powered it's going to be powered by this over here so if I bring you down to here, I bring you to here, I bring you to right here, and then I can connect you to there. There we go. And now we bring this back, right? So now, let's get it all the way the hell up here that's too long are you seriously going to tell me that that's too long you jerk come on i tell you guys this is freaking hella scary this is so scary because i know like i am up so freaking high I'm up so high. And I'm only getting up higher <laughs> as we sit here and talk. As we sit here and discuss, I'm only going up higher, right? It's so annoying. It's so bad. Like, and I don't want to walk backwards because I've got turns. And I could see myself walking backwards right off the freaking right off a cliff. Alright. Okay, now we're straight pretty straight for a while. <laughs> I think I'm going to run out of freaking steel before I can do this. Before I get this whole thing done. I'm pretty sure I'm going to run out of steel before I get this whole thing done. But we're going to get it pretty far. We're going to get it pretty far. Oh, stop it, Cuban. Okay. 
This is a long way to bring coal. This is a really long way to bring coal. But it's okay. We got to do it, right? It's part of the process. Ugh, I am like a nervous wreck right now. Like, so nervous. I'm just going to fall off of this thing again and die. It's so embarrassing. And that stupid moth keeps flying by me, scaring the crap out of me as well. Look at it clip through my bridge, or my conveyor hub, or whatever we want to call this. Bridge of death. That's what I'm going to call it, the bridge of death. I am like not even close, guys. I am not even close. I've got such a long way to go before this sinks. Got such a long way to go before this thing's done. Holy cow. Um, you're gonna go right there. I'm just gonna keep you going. Got, I think, two more turns. And then we'll be, we'll be in good shape. Once I'm over the water, like, I'm, I, I won't be so fearful. Like, right now, I think I'm over the void. So if I fall, I'm dead. There's, there's no surviving that. Pretty sure I'm over the void. Or I'm over the edge of the land. And there are some bad guys down there that will freaking take me out pretty quick. Because I'll be like a one hit, like dead. One hit dead, you know? I'm also coming to the conclusion I am not going to make it all the way to the base with the amount of conveyor that I have. I don't think. got 140 steel left. I don't think I'm going to make it. Um, pretty sure. Pretty sure I'm not going to make it. But we're going we're gonna to go as far as we can. And then we'll go back to the base and get some more steel. It's going to be fine. Nope, that's not... Oh, that's not what I wanted. Definitely not going to make it. Definitely not going to be. I don't even think I'm going to make it to my next intersection. I might, though. I might make it to my next intersection. We'll see. I know I don't have to wait for it. Like, I can just, like, leave it. But I like to wait for it. Let's go back to here. So that I can make this turn properly. Now we can go straight until I run out. Which is going to say can't afford. So you know what? I may as well stop. Because if I can't afford, if I can only afford like 11 or 12, then it's, it's pointless. Um, so we have to go back to the base, pick up more steel. Water's not deep enough to jump off here. Otherwise I would. It's simply not. <clears throat> okay. I gotta say, though, this thing turned out pretty freaking amazing. Like, when we get the trains, holy cow. I'll be able to use this thing to make a train network. That's gonna be cool. This is a big bridge. Very, very big. I should have gone that way, but whatever. I don't have any steel here. Got steel back at the old base. Um, I don't need Mark 3 from the iron, but I do need Mark 2. Could probably get the iron connected. Which will be that guy over there. Uh, could also be this guy, but I'll probably do the one closer to the base itself. Makes a lot of sense, right? Like, why, why take the more difficult of the iron? And I'm probably going to do it as 240 right away. I might make that a Mark II and make it 240 so that I can set up the next floor. Next time we stream, we set up the next floor. Um, it's a little bit of a bummer that it took me so long to find the recipe that I needed, but at the end, it was totally worth it, right? In the end, finding that recipe was worth it. And we found some other pretty good ones, too. So I'm cool with that. I'm okay with that. All right, let's get over here to where we need to be. 
I believe there's going to be some spiders or something around here soon that are going to want to eat my face. Don't know what they're protecting. But there's spiders, from what I remember. Uh, there we go. <clears throat> go around this side. Now we have to go all the way around, right? And let's go grab whatever steel I've got. Steel beams is really what I need. I need these guys. So let's grab a few stacks of that. Because I have such a freaking long way to travel. Is there anything else? Um, I don't need all these freaking screws, that's for sure. Let's get those going into the awesome sink. Um, what else? Uh, rest of this, I guess I'll hang on to. I'll hang on to it. Okay. Let's head back over so that we can... <clears throat> I wonder if it'd be quicker for me to go that way. Because I didn't, I didn't delete my... Uh, my path up, but I don't think I have a way to get to it, do I? Do I have an easy way to get to that coal? I don't think I do. There is not an easy way to get to that coal, is there? Um, yeah, there is. Yeah, there is. It's over here. Pretty sure if I go this way... I think, think if I go by way of the Caterium, I think I can get to the coal over there. I think. If not, I guess we'll find out, right? But I'm pretty sure I can get to the coal this way. I'm fairly certain, and it looks like I can. Perfect. We should leave this here for future use, just in case. You never know. I might actually need it. I needed it today, so I may need it again in the future, you know? <clears throat> okay. Oh, oh, no. I don't want to end up underneath there. My luck, I'd glitch through the floor and fall, right? Mm. Do do do. Boy, this is such a long way. Oh my gosh. I still can't believe I did this. I seriously cannot believe I did this. This is craziness. Ran all of this conveyor all the way across here. Craziness. Absolute craziness. And then when I do this Caterium, I'm going to have to do something similar, right? Let's see here. Mark three. And away we go. And it's too long. Okay. So we're going to go right there. And we are going to continue. Do, 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 and right there. And onward and upward. We're almost there, guys. We're so close. What a, what a freaking undertaking this was. Holy cow. But hey, if you're thinking about doing it, now you know it's possible. And it's not that tough. It's just scary. It's just a little scary. You know, because you're up so damn high. But other than that, it wasn't so bad. I say that now. Now that I'm over the water, or like if I fall, I'm okay. Right? Which is what I said. I said as soon as I get over the water, I'll be comfortable. I'll be a lot more comfortable. Um, there. Onward. And there. And onward. And don't fall off, Cuban. Because that would be terrible. And here you have to make a turn. So you're gonna have to go like that. Like that. 
And that puts you in the same spot. And then all the way we go. Oh, this is the home stretch, guys. Home freaking stretch. We're almost there. Almost there. Almost there. And keep it going. Word. All right. Oh boy. Okay. Can I do this one? Yes. All right. And can't go there, but you can go there. Okay. And then I got to figure out how I'm going to get it down there. Let's see, so right here. Okay, so let me let me just take a quick look at what's going on under here. So I could go down essentially right here and go over. Right, like if I put a... If I put a uh, logistics, one of these right here... And I put a Mark III lift. Right there. I can't tell if that's connected or not. So let's do this. I think that's glitching through it. So let's get rid of this. Let's get rid of this. Let's do a Mark III lift. Like that. And now... Come on. There we go. Is it going to make it? No. It doesn't make it. But I can make it to here. And then I can make it to there. And that should go down. Okay. Then from down below, oh boy, okay. From down below, I should be able to mark three lift. This down. Let's see how low I can get it. How low would it let me go? Is it inside the wall though? Right there? It's inside the wall, darn it. So what if I did it to there, right? And then what if I connected another one to there, like so? I'm okay with that. And then what I would want to do is grab some foundations. Maybe two meter. So I want to be above, I want to be just above the water. Let's see. Yeah, I want to be just above the water. Oh my gosh, I did that. Look at this. How did I do this? I lined it perfectly with where I needed to go. How the heck did I pull that off? I don't even know. I don't even know how I did that. I honestly don't. I, I, don't, I don't think I could do that again if I wanted to. How the heck did I do that? All right, so you're gonna come out of here. To there. That's pretty straight, right in the center, which is what I want. And then you're gonna come to there. And we're gonna bring you all the way down.
And then what I'll probably do is make sure that my, my base I build will build above this conveyor. <clears throat> Which from the looks of it, I can. Okay, so what I gotta do now is I need a Mark III lift going like that. And what I could actually do, yeah, I'm, mm, that's what we're gonna do. I gotta do it. I gotta do it. <laughs> I have to. There we go. And that's gonna start feeding in all of the um, coal is going into all of our refineries. And now I have to do the same, something similar with my iron, which I'm gonna do pretty much the same exact setup. Um, I'm gonna do it exactly the same way. You see how it's going down though? I don't like that. I don't like that. But it is what it is. We'll just get rid of this. Hmm. Not a real big fan of how that turned out, but it's that whole height difference. That stupid height difference, man. It sucks. It really, really sucks. But what can you do? We're going to leave this be for now. Now let's go find... Our next iron and bring it over there now as well. Now I could use that same path. I could I could bring it over and then turn and whatever. Um, probably would be better than using this one. If I use the one down here and I take it to here somehow don't even know how the heck I'm going to do that right now um hmm because this is this one's in a really messed up spot like I'd have to like go all the way over there across the copper one no I'm thinking the other one's my better bet let's use the other one I can reposition it, face it that way. Yeah. It's gonna kinda get in the way of my path, but that's okay. That's okay. Let's go to production. Minor mark two. Oh, I don't have an, I don't have enough okay, minor mark one then. For the moment, we'll do mark one. Um, I need foundations, two meter foundations here, so I can face this the right way. Um, production, miner. There we go. And then we need you, you along with you. And then I need foundations and you. Come on, you can do it. There we go. Okay, so how am I gonna get that down here? I think we're just gonna have to hug this. Um but I kind of want to go up and then over so that if I want to use this path, I can. So if I do a Mark three conveyor, and let's just say I went, no, 
No, gotta do that again. Mark three conveyor. And I went up, I don't know, that many, right? Then I kind of took this over there, like so. Got rid of this tree. Let's see here. You get rid of a lot of this stuff. Cause I'm, I'm just kind of using this to line it up at the moment. There we go. Then I can go that way, right? So let me see here. If I bring that to here. Like that. Now can I do a Mark III lift on here to go this way? So that way I can get rid of that. I think that works. And that means I can get rid of that. And then if I do, you come all the way to here. You go here first, then you come to here. Get rid of that one. And I do a Mark III lift here. And then I go down, see where I want this to end up. I could even come like here. You know what? Let's do it. I think I can afford to come back one more. Let's see. Um, let's bring it to here first. And then we're going to end it here. And now I can do the three. And then let me go down there. See where this ends up. Yeah, this is really good. Because it's not clipping right there either. Um, right there. I'm good with that. And then if I do... Let's see here. Foundations. And I go two meter ramps. Can I, can I follow these? All the way to here. But instead of this one, I go all the way to there. I think that works. And then I can get rid of you. And I can get rid of you. And I can get rid of you, and you, and you, and you, and you. Perfect. Put one of those right here. And then let's bring this down. All the way down. See if it'll let me come all the way. It does. It's not where I wanted to. All right, that's fine. Um. To there. Nope. There. And then you are gonna go all the way in to there. And then we're just going to go all the way to the end of that. And now we're golden. All I have to do now is turn on that miner. And then we got to power all of that and we're good.
and I can even get rid of all of this. Because I don't even really... Actually, we'll leave it. It's fine. It's fine. It can stay. It can stay. It's not hurting anything. All right, so now powering this bad boy should be relatively simple because I had already set up a post for it right there. There we go. That's gonna start bringing iron down. Okay, let's go get this stuff connected with power. So how am I gonna run power down there? That's the next question. Um, what's my easiest way to get power down there? Let's see here. Um, you are gonna come across to here. This is probably not ideal, but this is what I'm going to do for the moment. Let me get down there. All right, this is this is going to hurt a little. Um, we'll probably fix this in the future, but for today, this is going to work just fine. Um, we'll put it right here. And then we need to go on this line. So we need to go here. <clears throat> In between these two. I've got a feeling I'm going to lose... I think I'm going to trip my power again after I set this all up. How much power do I have? Hmm... So my max consumption is at 892 as of right now. I've got a feeling I'm going to hit that pretty quick. Oh, this isn't working. Oh, no. Hold on. Why isn't this working? Did I not connect it? Oh, that's why. Okay. Duh. Wait. Yeah, I didn't connect it. There it goes. There it goes. So these should kick on here momentarily. <clears throat> Yep, those are kicking on. Okay, this I'm, I'm probably going to lose power here, guys. Probably. So this is my next row right here. So you're going to be right here. And you're going to be right here. Actually, we should get rid of that. You're going to be right here. Right here. Like that. Then we got one more. And it's going to be this row. It's going to be right... No. Yeah, yeah, this row. You're going to be right here, and you're going to come over, and we're going to go right, right here, and right here. All right. And then at this point, we're making steel beams. Look at that. So then what I'll do is next time I stream, guys, we will, now that we've got everything here um, I think I need to go get industrial uh, 
modular frames. I think I need to go get modular frames before I can upgrade my miner to tier two. Steel in the steel, yeah. Um, in order for me to make the tier two, I need to go make one more miner and I need some modular frames. Okay. Well, you know what? I want to get this done, so let's go do it. Let's go ahead, head back. I've got, I think, the truck giving me an error. Yeah, the tractor is out of fuel because there's no more coal being fed to it. <laughs> Whoopsies. Uh, we're going to end up getting rid of it anyway. Um, but yeah, that's kind of unfortunate that it's out of fuel. That sucks. Oh, well. I've got fuel on me. I can actually refuel it. I can refuel it so I can keep running. Yeah, I'll throw the fuel into the... Um... I can fuel it. I can use biofuel for a bit. Just until it empties out the steel production. But it's also trying to empty out <clears throat> the modular frame production that I have. Which I also have to recreate. Um, here relatively soon. <laughs> now that I think about it, I completely forgot about the fact that I have a modular frame setup going, and that's going to hurt. Yeah, I knew that was going to hurt. Um, are these guys respawning, or did I not kill these? Maybe I never killed those guys. That's okay, though. Modular frames, I think, is what I need anyway. Now, I do have some here. So that's no big deal. Gosh, these roads turned out so nice. Um, right, it is it is modular frames, right? Yeah. So let's grab a stack of 50 of those. Um, and let's go put some more stuff in the truck here. We've got grass. There's the wood. There's the grass and the flowers I can trash. Let's go put this fuel in the tractor so that it can keep running. And then I'm also gonna grab some, I should have grabbed more encased industrial beans, but whatever. Poor guy. My little guy ran out of fuel. <laughs> He's like, I can't run anymore. Like, too bad, buddy. This is all gonna get taken apart soon. He just stopped right there. He's getting ready to bring a load over. Um, there you go, buddy. Have fun with that. I'm going to head back. It's going to take me a minute, but I got I to gotta head to this base first. I didn't grab... I should have grabbed those, um, those in case beams he had. It's okay. It's okay. The copper facility is done. Um, I could probably get rid of all of that up there as well. It's all done. I got rid of the miner. See, at this point, the only thing being made is anything with quick wire. It looks like. Which... I don't need that anymore either. But it's all just going into the awesome sink, so who cares, right? Who cares? Let it let it just go into the awesome sink. It's not using up that much power. Gosh, that thing is just so ginormous. Holy cow. Oh, I didn't make my... Mm, production equipment workshop. Let's make a miner. There we go. I needed one more miner. So that I can turn that iron deposit into a tier two, to a tier two miner. <clears throat> this'll, this'll be the last thing I do for tonight is upgrade this miner to a tier two, or mark two, I should say. It's not tier two, it's mark two. 
And then, to, not tomorrow, but if I stream um, potentially Tuesday, I might be streaming this again. Um, we'll do the next module, if not two modules, because now that we have everything there, we've already ran the coal, we've already ran the iron. We might be able to make two modules. I don't think I can do a Mark III miner yet, though, so two modules is probably not going to be very realistic. Um, look at that. So freaking cool. So cool. I love the way this is turning out. Moving to this location was a good idea. I wish I would have started here. Although starting here and not being able to, like, I, it would have been tough. There was a lot of enemies I had to take care of that I don't know if I could have taken care of early game. It's because I have this basher <laughs> that I can do it. Um, okay, so in order to make you a Mark II miner, done. That is now a Mark II miner. Um, so I'm just gonna show you guys really quick how we would set up the second floor. This is super simple. So, I believe I got to go up four. So three. I don't think three is high enough. I could be wrong, but I, I'm, I'm fairly certain three isn't high enough. Uh, catwalk stairs, we'll do them right here. Um, let's see here. I think I gotta go four. Oh noes. Oh noes what? Hang on. What are we talking about? You know what? I think I gotta go four. But instead of that, what I wanna use is I kinda wanna use these. This is like cool looking, right? So like if I got this in this corner right here. All right, let's just say I pop one of these on here. That's one. And then I go two. Like, are these the height of a wall? Sure seems like they are. Yeah, so that's two, three. Just want to see how high does a wall go. That's three. So one more of these would be four. But instead of that... Here we go. What if we did this? Oh, that's cool. I like that. I like that a lot. And then if I go foundations, one meter foundations, and I go across here, I should put my foundation on top of that. Um, is that going to mess up my spacing, though? Is that gonna mess up spacing? One, two, three, four. It shouldn't. It wants to put it on top, which means, oh, it's it would be on top of the floor. Instead of, okay, let me grab the catwalk stairs now work my way up there, or work my way down there. Nope, not there. Nope. There. No, that's not where you're supposed to be. Uh, why aren't you snapping to the top? I want, yes, that's where I wanted you to snap, top. Yes, please, and thank you. Okay, so essentially the same setup. Um, and then I get rid of this one. And then I can do this, right? So it'll essentially be the same setup, right? I, I will lay this floor down and um, for example, right here would be a single conveyor wall right here. And then matching that, there would be a single conveyor wall right here. Okay. So then if we go back down here, 
<clears throat> and we go here, what we would do is I would grab a mark. Let's just do a mark three. But I got to do it from up top because I can't really see. So why don't we do that? Let's go. Let's do it from up top. It's like it's hard to see. It's really, really hard to see how this is lining up. If I put this here, it should give me enough view that I can kind of go like this, like that. No, like that. Is that? That looks like it's lined up. So let's take a look. That looks pretty good to me, right? And then we do the same thing on that side. So if I grab one of you and I pop you right there and I go like that, And I come over here, pop Mark II in there, right? <clears throat> then we're good. And the beauty is, if I get a third, like let's say I get this up to 360, I can get the third level to come up on this side. And it won't interfere with this, right? So that's pretty cool. Okay, we can get rid of you, and you, and you. And there we go. So this this floor, this this will be this this will be the same. This will be the same. This will be the same. But what will happen is there'll be six constructors um, to make the. Let me see. Hang on. I've got my diagram. There'll be six constructors to make the pipes. And then I'll be making a ton of pipes. And then the third floor. I would probably use to make, you know, the encased beams or something like that, right? Um, I would take some of, you know, like, let me just take a look here. I, if, let's say I was going to do the encased industrial beam, it would be a very similar setup. So I would bring in concrete, and then I would bring in steel pipes from one of these other floors, right? Like I'm going to be producing enough steel beam and enough steel pipe that I can put floors on top of this for, to produce, you know, whatever I need to produce, right? Um, or if I wanted to make a, a lot of steel pipe, then I can make another floor of steel pipe or another floor of steel beam. Um, that's kind of the idea behind this modular setup that I'm thinking. Gosh, this is so cool. So if I go here, you know, I, I'm going to, I'm not going to build up that side though, because I want to see how wide do I actually need this thing to be. I've got a feeling that I've got this thing wider than it needs to be. Um, let's grab you. I'm going to put you right here. And let's grab you. Like that. And let's grab you. And you can go down there. There we go. So that's freaking cool. That's very industrial looking with these things, man. Holy crap. Look at that. That looks... If I, if I encase this in windows, that'll be cool looking. I could have done the skinnier ones, but I like the big guys. I think those look nice. So anyways, guys. I'm going to call it a night. I got the uh, I got the steel production going here. Um, it will not take long to re to build this again in a and to make pipes. And I may even do it off stream so that you know since it's it, we're literally doing the same thing. This is the same. This is the same. This is the same. And this is even sort of the same. Um, except I will stagger. I'll stagger the constructors. So there'll be another constructor just slightly in front of this constructor where I can notch it in like right here, right? I can notch it in. This will split to it, right? So the that port will be like right here. 
kind of... Let me see if I can... It'll be like right... There? Have a few beers. It will make staggering easier. <laughs> so it'll kind of go right there, right? It's kind of my thought. And then they'll all kind of get merged together into into the into that thing. So that's that. So I I will get this. I will get it built maybe all the way to this point, and then we can do the constructors together on Tuesdays. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me. If you're enjoying this series, please hit please please hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed. It doesn't cost you anything, and it helps me out a ton. The YouTube algorithm loves when you subscribe, when you comment, when you chat, when you share, when you like. So it would help me out. But anyways, thank you so much for choosing to watch me. I appreciate that. You could be watching anybody else that is probably way better at this than I am, which is just about everybody because I'm brand new. But anyways, thanks for hanging out with me. And as always, I'll catch you guys next time.